linen suit, right? What? Front row. You said that's where they were sitting? Yeah. Linen suits. Three piece. Looking sharp. Ooh, I'm going to give me one of them suits. Okay. Next stop, I can set it up, Jay. I'll get you the best tailor. Get you one in every cup. Ooh, that's so. Anything you want? Anything. I'll talk to him, okay? I'm eating him for brandy in 15 minutes, but I can't promise you anything, Jay. It ain't what I do. I never done it. It ain't good business. Sometimes I think you forget how good this boy is. I don't forget. I can't. Not even if I wanted to. He's Jay Jackson. So good at the sport, they call him the sport. Ain't a paper in this country doesn't run his picture once a week. That stupid one. The one I hate. The one with a smile and that fucking hat. It's a $50 hat. Bigger star as Jay might be. Bixby never fought a Negro. No heavyweight champ ever has. But don't think that you should take it personal. Ain't like he's a bigot. He likes him fine. In fact, his driver's a Negro. He just, what his people say is, they see no reason to step in the ring with you. He's retired. Simple as that. He didn't come out for Hutchinson. He wasn't Jay. He wasn't black. And Bixby ain't coming out of retirement for a title fight half this country won't recognize. I ain't fighting half this country. Post said he would disgrace his legacy just by stepping into that ring with you. Right. How would you like it if I asked Jay to step into a ring with a goddamn grizzly bear? We'll find you a challenger, okay? We'll find you 20. I got two boys in Nigeria right now looking for the biggest, meanest ogre motherfuckers they can find. We'll get them visas, we'll bring them over, we'll sell a million tickets. You can knock their lights out. Exhibition, one after the other. Ah, we'll laugh about it. Mm, big 